Hey guys, what's up? And thanks for stopping by my channel, Crystal Michelle. And today I'm here to show you guys how I achieve goddess braids. And I'm using kinky straight extensions to give me that long look. But you can use connect along hair, Marley hair, whatever you have on hand. I'm showing you guys how I part my hair. And also, um... Any products you have on hand, your favorite gel, edge control, I'm using the curls and the Shea Moisture Mousse pretty much just to give me just the right amount of hold. I'm pretty much laying down my edges before I begin because I find it makes it a lot easier to do this style and I also am performing this on stretched old old hair um, if your hair isn't stretched and of course you can blow dry also depending on your texture so you really get that nice smooth look now I'm just showing you guys how I place my extensions I have them on the side and I added about two tracks per side just to give it some fullness and some length but you, like I said before you can do this with connect along hair whatever you have on hand I'm adding a little bit of mousse of course to just give me a really nice smooth look and all I'm gonna do is pretty much cornrow my hair going Going down the sides. I started off in the beginning using my own hair just so I get those three strands to make life a lot easier and then I just begin to braid. The key to doing this which I feel gives me a really great neat look is that I'm going to take a piece from the bottom and incorporate it then I take a piece from the top and incorporate it and I continue doing this going down um, my hair so that way I make sure that I'm getting an even amount of hair from the bottom as you can see and then once again I'm going to take another piece from the top so that way it really lays flat and covers over those clipping tracks and then you're pretty much going to continue this all the way until you get to the base of your head I know cornrowing is not the easiest thing but there are so many videos on YouTube that show you how to achieve that but once you get the hang of it it's really easy because my hair is stretched it's not hard to incorporate it and because this is kinky straight hair extensions my hair blends in wonderfully with these extensions the extensions um, I received them from evilwigs.com they're in 18 inches if you guys would like a review please hit the like button and right now guys what I'm doing is once again smoothing down my edges if I had time it would to tie down a scarf but my cheat is to just pull my edges to the braid and sneak a little bobby pin in there to make sure it lays really flat if you guys have a scarf in five minutes of your time you can also tie it down to make sure your edges are laid or use a really really strong gel now for the opposite side I'm starting this braid a little bit further back to really give me that nice sleek goddess braid appearance and look and once again I'm gonna start off with my three sections this time incorporating a little bit of the kinky straight um, clip-ins and then once I braid it a few times I can see my three distinct hair strands I'm going to then begin to braid the only difference this time is that I'm mostly taking hair from the top and then incorporating it in because I want this braid to be just a little bit lower so as you guys see I keep taking pieces from the top and then incorporating it into the braid and I'll braid it about two times before grabbing another piece to make sure that you really see these distinct defined parts Once you're done coring all the way to the base of your head, then you're just going to do a simple braid all the way down until you get to the very end. Of course, because this is kinky straight here, you're not going to really have to worry about your hair unraveling. However, if it does, you can always add um, a rubber band at the ends or add some control paste or gel to make sure it has hold at the tips. All I'm doing right now is just adding a little bit of mousse to make sure that my hair is laying really flat. Of course, like I said before, if you have time, you can go ahead and tie a scarf down to get that sleek look. But we're pretty much already at the end and all I'm going to do is show you guys how I take style 1 to style 2. You can do this with any length. Of course, I find it really easy with these clip-in extensions. And this is called the Halo Goddess Braid. All you're going to do is just wrap one end to one side. I'm just going to tuck those ends away and then I just bobby pin it. And then I repeat the same on the other side. It's as easy as that. It kind of takes you from, you know, a regular cute sleek look to a more sophisticated look. And I really love the Halo Goddess Braid. And I also wish I had like some hair pieces or hair jewelry to really accentuate this look. But guys, this was a super easy tutorial. It probably took me no more than 10 to 15 minutes. Let me know what you guys think of it. As always, happy healthy hair journey. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Please don't forget to share, subscribe, rate, and comment. And thanks for stopping by my channel. Check out my other videos and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.